เออเคยนั่งประจำที่เสร็จฉันไม่นั่งนี่เลยนะนี่แอลเคยนั่งเจ้าหนูเป็นผู้นั้นมีคนแต่เมื่อวานมันจะมีคนเออมองแล้วมันจะเดินแล้วไอ้ข้อมูลนั่นแหละเห็นตรงนี้ก็ใช่เออเออเอออยู่ตัวเองนะเออไม่ใช่ก็เจอสลับก็ไปนั่งนี่มาแต่ไม่มีคนเลย
Morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, sir. Good morning. Are there any uh, questions about uh, yesterday's uh, work? <laughs> Well, that's okay. Maybe you'll have a question tomorrow. So you will be here for three weeks or four weeks? Uh, eight weeks. Eight weeks. Oh. Uh, October, end of October. For a long time. Yeah. Okay. You'll be able to practice in it with you so long time. What? we will be practice in it with you. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, very good. Uh, <clears throat> There's no questions about what we discussed yesterday, or are there questions about what we discussed yesterday? If not, we'll move on. Okay, practice uh, some reading here. Hong Kong, but no money and visa. And you? Where you 
you can hear English or at home or you can listen on radio or television, something like that. So keep that in mind and try to do it every day. The police were called to the scene of a robbery. The storekeeper said that a man entered the store, pointed a gun at him while demanding money. The storekeeper gave him the money in the cash register. The robber fled from the store. Store fled. Don't forget the end of the word. While demanding money. The police were called to the scene of a robbery. And the storekeeper said that the man entered the store, pointed a gun at him while demanding money. The storekeeper gave him the money in the cash register. The robber fled from the store. Go ahead. Yeah. yeah. The police were called the to the scene of the robbery. Robbery. Uh, robbery. The storekeeper <laughs> say that a man entered into the stone, the stone point, point a gun at him, point at a gun at him while be be on be demanding 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 money. The the storekeeper give him the money. What? Okay. The the storekeeper gave him the money in the cash register. Uh, the the like, robot. Robot. English. The robot break from the store. Robber, wait. Robber. Uh, the robber fled from the <laughs> store. <laughs> what is this word? The store. 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 You go shopping in a store. Store. Not stone. Not stole. But store. Store. Okay, go ahead. The police were called to the scene of robbery. The storekeeper said that a man entered the store. Twice the gun at him while demanding money. The storekeeper gave him the money in the cash register. The robber fled from the store. Right, robber fled from the store. The police were called to the scene of a robbery. The storekeeper said that a man entered the store and pointed a gun at him while he made the money. The storekeeper gave him the money in the cash register. The robber fled from the store. Go ahead, Mr. Drake. The police called to the Uh, 
Lobster. Flail. Fled. 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 The robber fled from the store. The police were called to the scene of a robbery. The storekeeper said that a man entered the store, pointed a gun at him while demanding money. The storekeeper gave him the money in the cash register. The robber fled from the scene. Okay, the police. Okay. The police were called to the scene of a robbery. The shop. The storekeeper said that a man entered the store, pointed a gun at him while demanding money. The storekeeper gave him the money in the cash register. The robber fled from the store. Yeah, exactly. That's very good. Uh, pointed a gun at him while demanding money. The storekeeper gave him the money in the cash register. And the robber fled the scene. The police were called to the scene of a robbery. The, uh, the storekeeper said that a man uh, ent entered the store, fight, fired a gun at him while demanding money. The storekeeper gave him money in the cash register. The robber fled from the store. Right, the robber fled from the store. The storekeeper gave him the money in the cash register. The cash register. The robber fled from the store. Go ahead. The police were called to the scene of the robbery. The storekeeper said that a man enters the store, quite a, a gun at him while demanding money. The store if the storekeeper gave him uh, the money in the cash register, the, the robber fled from the store. Right. The storekeeper gave him the money in the cash register. Reg is ter. Register. Reg is ter. Register. Register. Cash register. Okay, go ahead. The police were called to the scene of the robbery. The storekeeper said that a man entered the store, pointed a gun at him while demanding money. The storekeeper gave him the money in the cash register. The robber fled from the store. Right, very good. The storekeeper gave him the money in the cash register. The, ro the robber fled fled from the store. Very good. Go ahead. The police were called to the scene of a robbery. The storekeeper said that a man entered. The store pointed a gun at him. While demanding money, uh, the storekeeper gave him the money in the cash register. The robber fled from the store. Right, very good. The police were called to the scene of a robbery. In other words, something bad happened. Mm -hmm. Somebody's on the phone, please come to this store, I have just been robbed. Boom. Police show up, boom. The police come. The storekeeper, the person in charge of the store, so may have been the only one in the store, or he may have had two helpers. But he was the store keeper, the person in charge of the store. And he said to the police when they arrived that a man entered the store, pointed a gun at him while demanding money. Give me the money. The storekeeper gave him the money in the King cash register. The robber fled the scene, or fled from the store. He left in a big hurry. To flee is to basically 
run away. He fled. Remember, this is all in the past tense. Call, flee, fled, fled, demanding money, gave, gave, gave. Not the storekeeper give, but the storekeeper gave him the money in the cash register. The robber fled, raced away as fast as he could from the store. Any questions about the words there? The scene? The place where it happened. The police were called to the place where the robbery occurred, which was the store. Right. Where it happened. To the scene of the crime. To the scene of the robbery. Storekeeper? Storekeeper is the owner. Not necessarily the owner, but the person who is in charge of the store. He may be the owner. He could be the owner, mm -hmm. but then he may be somebody hired by the owner to run the store. Therefore, he could be the owner or the person that the owner hired to take care of the store. Mm -hmm. Whatever he was, he was in charge of the store. He was the keeper. He said that a man had entered, come in, entered, pointed a gun at him while, give me the money. Demanding the money. The storekeeper gave him the money in the cash register. The robber fled the scene. Pronunciation is important. Yeah. Understanding the words is one thing. <laughs> Pronouncing them correctly is another. <laughs> so concentrate. My best advice would be to concentrate as much as you can on the pronunciation. Understand one thing, but pronunciation is important. <laughs> Very important. Yeah. Because then, otherwise, people won't understand what you're talking about. Yeah. Are, are there any questions about the words here? Yeah. This the the furry will call to the the local Call to the scene. The scene. The scene that is the place in this particular case. The scene is the place where the robbery occurred. It's the store. They were called to the store. Storekeepers were called to the store. I understand it. What? Storekeepers were called to the store. Oh, yeah. The police were called to the scene of a robbery. Well, you can take it as the storekeeper called. He was the one that was robbed. I've been robbed. What do I do? Oh, I think I'll call the police. So the storekeeper uh, assumed that that is who made the phone call. Somebody called the police. It was most likely the storekeeper. He's the guy that got robbed. So, uh, you know, he's the one. It's not a person passing by said, oh, better call. No, he called the police. And they came, and he explained. They came to the scene, the location, the scene, of the robbery, the location where it occurred, and they took a statement from the storekeeper as to what happened. Any other questions about it? Investigation? Problem? Everything okay? Oh, here it is. Keep moving on your racing. Gave. Past tense. Gave. 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 Called. Past tense. This is all, the robbery is something that happened, let's say, two hours ago. So it's not right happening, no. It's in the past. What? Sin. Sin. What about it? Sin. 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 Sin, yeah. What about sin? S C S is sometimes I pronounce No, second C. Is pronouncing C. Oh, okay. In other words, it's almost a C. C. Or it could or I mean, the per, that's why I say the pronunciation is important because really, it, that's the pronunciation. Uh, it's not scheme. It's C. Some of the letters in this case, this particular C is kind of not there. Just have to let it go. Uh, 
But that's the practice that re is required to do this correctly. Skiing, if you said the skiing, he, he fled the skiing. He fled the skiing, what's he talking about? No, he fled the skiing. But that, that is where the practice comes in and, you know, studying the, or learning the pr proper pronunciation. Because you may know what it means, but if you're calling it skiing, people are going to, whoop, what? What's he talking about? And S-C-R-E-E-M, scream. S-C-R-E-E-M, scream. Well, that's a totally different word, yeah, scream. Scream. Uh, uh, well, that's the problem with English. You, you, I could stand here for, for 10 minutes writing words down that scream and scream and scene and scene, rump, 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 rump. steam, <laughs> you know, it, it just goes on and on. That's why there are so many words that sound alike, but have no, nothing in, in common with the meaning of, uh, of the word, of the words. So that's why it's important to work on the pronunciation, too, of all these words. Because, it, as you know, I'm sure, over the years of studying, that there are many, many words that have a similar sound but a totally different meaning. Joe and Fred is the past thing. Fred. Yeah. Fred. Oh, they're from the Fred. No, no. Fred is the name of a person. Fred. And Fred. Fine. Remember. L L and R. R L V. Fred. Is Fred coming to the dinner tonight? Yes, Fred will be there. But in this case, the robber fled, fled, led, led, led the scene. Fled the scene. Or you could say that if Fred was the robber, Fred fled. Fred fled. So uh, Fred fled? Yeah, Fred was the robber. So Fred fled, but that that it, it, that's the total difference. Well, LRV. Those are the tough letters, the hard ones sometimes to pronounce. And fled. Fred. Fred. Fled. Who? What? 